ladies and gentlemen, on this debate. I am joined by Menendra Rijal, member of the House of Representatives of Nepal's Parliament, former Minister of Information and Technology in Nepal. Mr. Menendra Rijal, thank you for joining me. We are also joined sure. by Subhash Ghimire, he is Editor-in-Chief of the Republica Daily from Kathmandu. And Prakash Rimal, editor of the Himalayan Times, also from Kathmandu. Thank you very much, Prakash ji, Subhash, for joining me. On the Indian side, we have Sushant Sareen, General G.D. Bakshi. Sushant Sareen is senior fellow at the Observer Research Foundation. General G.D. Bakshi is a well-known strategic affairs writer and uh, editor of the Indian Military Review. And uh, Syed Zafar Islam, spokesperson of the BJP. Thank you, gentlemen. I would like to start by asking you, Mr. Rijal. Yes. That you must understand, and I don't want to be giving gratuitous advice to you. Maybe General Bakshi can debate this with you better. But China is nobody's friend. China is alone in the world now. In the world community, China is alone. You are also very aware that this sudden interest in Indian territory, it's laughable. Uh, you are, of course, uh, an important nation, but if you think you're squaring off with India on border issues, you should be dreaming. It's never going to happen. Uh, we're not going to talk to you about it. But I only wanted to start by telling you this, that the Lipu Lake Pass in Kalapani, which is an Indian territory, is a very important vantage point for India to keep an eye on Chinese movements. So strategically, Mr. strategically Baxi, we so keep an eye on Chinese movements a for a long time. A yeah, let me complete my question, sir. My question is, okay. China, I believe that you are just being egged on by China. China is using you because Lipu Lake Pass in Kalapani is an important strategic point for India to keep an eye on Chinese movements, right, for a long time, for more than 40, 50 years, right? Uh, you must not compromise the India-Nepal friendship just to give China a small strategic advantage. Also, personally, I am of the view that it makes Chi Nepal look like a, uh, what do you call a rentier state of China. You need not take Chinese foreign policy as your own interests, and you should not aggravate the situation with India. Now, you are free to make your point. Yes, go ahead, sir. First of all, I mean, the way you are saying me, it sounds like you are giving me a statement, giving me a message. That's that's certainly not the, not the style how television interviews are done in Nepal. First of all, I mean, if you ask me where Nepal stands, what are the facts, how we think this should be resolved, and then I'll be able to answer that question. I very strongly t uh, would like to put this fact that this the, the border issue is an outstanding issue. India is committed to resolve this through bilateral means, diplomatic means. This is precisely what uh, your government has said. I mean, when we sent a note that the... Uh, uh, foreign secretaries of both sides should uh, hold meeting, hold consultation. The uh, uh, letter that we received was once two nations and two societies uh, uh, are done dealing with uh, uh, the uh, challenges of the COVID-19 crisis, uh, then two countries can sit down. We have said, I mean, this can be done even earlier. So uh, I would not like to incite this further, but the thing is, we have said very clearly that we would like to uh, present all the evidences that are there, and then the government of India can also produce its evidences. No. Both sides can sit no, down no. and talk, sir, and then we, this could be resolved. You know, that Here way, that way, China that way with... Uh, what China with, is not doing, and uh, what I should do, and what I yeah. should not do. This is not what you should be saying. You Mine, should be the, Mr. Opinion. Rijal. You may disagree with me. Mr. That's Rijal, let me tell thing. you what is offensive. I am, I am being very subtle and very polite. On the other hand, may I tell you no, what you is... May no, I, you are not. May I, may I tell you what is offensive? I'll give you an example, and I don't know how interviews are done in Nepal, but I know how they are done in India. This is how we do it. Your country's prime okay, minister but, but has I mean, said. Look, I mean, first of all, I mean, let, let me make it very clear that if we are not, if we do not respect as people of two different nations, if we do not respect each other as individuals who have their views so the, and their the comment from the then we probably would not have a very nice conversation. But the, we have the, to be very the, clear on that. Yeah, the problem is that your prime minister said... So when you said, say you should do your, it, your, you should do this, I'm, you I'm, do Okay, that, so that, I'll get you into the debate you, with General Bakshi. Me. I'll get you into the debate with General Bakshi. But I'll tell you this. Of course. That your country's prime minister 
said that the coronavirus strain coming from India is more lethal than the coronavirus strain coming from China. Can you explain this? What kind of a comment is that? First, I mean, look. look Why did he say that? Look, I will. Can, can I answer the, your question? Yeah, yeah, sure. First of all, uh, the government, the prime minister, and we, there are issues that we, we, uh, we differ. We are in the opposition, he is in the government, there might be issues, the way I mean, this is presented, there, there, there could be differences. But the thing is, on, on the border issue, we're together. On the border issue, we will no, we no, fully no, support can... the position Prime Minister okay. has taken. No. How he presents it is, is his style. I, uh, sir, different but, leaders but in the world... I, feel, I, feel, I was just very intrigued. I, cannot, uh, I... I was just very intrigued that... And now I hand over to G.D. Bakshi and Sushant and others who want to debate with you. I was just very intrigued. But, what but, is the what is the epidemiological Arun, or scientific please, basis? Mr. Arun, you see, Arun, uh, Mr. Arun, Mr. Arun, Rijal, Arun, Mr. Rijal, Mr. Rijal, can I make one point please, and I'm I'm going to listen to, to you? But I want to know Arun, how talk? did how did the Nepalese Prime Minister say that the China coronavirus strain is good, but the India coronavirus strain is bad? I mean, it's it's crazy. I I, I am not Why an is he making this corona. I will, cannot answer your question. I it's a pattern, approve, I see. I mean, I approve of Prime Minister... Hang on, hang on. I approve Prime Minister's position on the border issue. I approve... Uh, no, no, but, but, uh, no, have but full support for what, what's what happened and why, you, why are you bent on spoiling the relationship? That's none of my business. No, why are you... My, my, I, all I, Indians are asking you, we else. like Nepal, we've had good relations with Nepal, Narendra Modi went to Nepal. What has come over Nepal? You suddenly want to fight with well, India? Well, I mean, I don't know what's going on. Do, okay, very, very, okay. Let, 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 very, let, let G.D. Bakshi respond to you, sir, now, please. Okay, but, but let, let, me, uh, let, me, let me make one point. You. Please, I mean, let's respect each other. Sure. We are kind of people from, of two different nations. There are these, the, the border issue is an outstanding issue. I should not be telling what you should be doing. You cannot be telling me what I should be doing. No, you, you do what is in your best interest, but think of the long-term consequences. Yes, of course. Yes, General Bakshi. Yes, of course. Yes, of course. Uh, yes. Uh, uh, I would like to state to my Nepalese friends, as the Indian Army sees it, we have the rishta of roti beti with the people of Nepal, right? Very few, no other country we have this. I would go a step further. I would say that we have the rishta of blood, kud. Gurkha soldiers, Gurkha boys in our Gurkha regiments have fought in each and every one of the wars that we fought with Pakistan, with China. They have shed blood for our country. We, especially in the Indian Army, and the Indian nation will never forget this. Please understand this. Please understand this. I think we yes. did a... Let me well, speak thank, to you thank, very, thank you very for saying, sir. frankly. Thank you. I am telling you very, very frankly, in our Congress era, we Indians have scored a self-goal by helping the Maoists come to power in Kathmandu. Look what they have done to you and what they have done to our relations, right? Relations which were so deep, so fraternal. Nobody needs a passport from uh, Nepal to come to India and vice versa, right? Does it happen with every country? We have a fraternal, deep relation. At one time, you were the only Hindu country in the world. You are one of the bastions of our culture. We, there is, you know, we are astounded. We have been taken aback that you are siding with China, and I will give you the reason for it, please. Let me be frank and talk as friends, can, can, can talk can frankly I, can to I, one can another. Can I respond to that? Can I just finish? Yeah, General, can I, can just I respond finish? to that? No, no, I'll, yeah. no, no, I'll just yeah, finish, yeah. then I would love to hear you. I would love to hear you. I yeah, would okay. give you, okay, to hear then. you with the fullest yeah. respect. I am saying, I am saying, a month plus back, there was a political crisis in Nepal. We do apologies because of the corruption of the present government, a lot of your legislators were upset and the government almost fell. You remember that? That was the time, let me be blunt and straightforward, the Chinese came to the rescue of the present establishment, they rescued you, 
well they paid a lot of people they paid a look let's let's talk honestly because friends can be very straightforward they paid the present government and they are now under duress to raise the border issue you think we are going to fight with you it is beneath the indian army and the indian army is not interested in fighting with you especially when the the point the road which you are talking of as it is is west of the river of the kali river mahakali yeah, river can, can i now the only can, question can is can i respond to that okay. please 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 can i respond to that first i mean i agree with you nepal and india have a special relationship I do not agree that uh, uh, China has to do anything with what happens here. I do not agree Come that on, you. Uh, so I mean, you, this probably you you can say uh, for the public cons public consumption in India. I can understand that. But the thing is, can I give India, you an evidence India, of that? India has its own can position. I, I Nepal has evidence? its own position. Uh, eminent group, eminent persons group has identified this point as as, as outstanding border border no, no, it's point. Not. No, no, no. Which eminent persons group, sir? Both sides have agreed which eminent that persons this group, sir? One second. Which which eminent persons and, and group? I may ask Nepal you. Nepal has not taken any. Which eminent no, no, persons no. group? I mean, you are you stopping me only. I mean, I mean, if you do not let me speak, sir, at I'm all, known then, I mean, to I'm known to ask counter questions, Mister. I don't understand why. Uh, am I? No, 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 no. Uh, do I have let, to be subservient first, to you? Let me first respond to. Uh, do I have to be subservient person. to you? I, 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 if you do not, no, please, please, uh, Arnav, if you do not let me respond to Mister. Baxi, then I mean. There is absolutely no point of having me on the television. No, no, but I, am I not allowed to counter you on anything? Not less, uh, let me respond to that. Then why, why do you have me on the television? C c can I, can I respond to Mr. Bucks's uh, point of view? Mm -hmm. Can I or not? Now go on, but okay. you know, I, 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 I also have a right to respond to you if you're factually incorrect. That's all I'm saying. Of course, I mean, you, you, you made a lot of points. I have not been able to respond to you also. You've said no, Nepal you has taken that's not my problem. Action. No, Nepal has not taken unilateral action. Mr. Bakshi said Prime Minister has taken certain positions. I mean, I cannot defend how he is running the government. No, no, I am opposition. There are certain things on tell which me one only thing. people from his party tell, tell me one government thing. I, I have a, now I want to counter you, sir. Sir, so now I want to counter you, sir. Do I have the permission to counter you? You made your point. I want to counter you and there are other panelists. Sushant also wants to counter you. Explain to me one thing. Sir, I'll tell you one thing, Mr. Rijal. I show no disrespect. But, yes. but I am not a believer in diplomatic extrasensory perception. I am not a believer in geostrategic telepathy. And I'll tell you why. I will prove to you on my program that you are acting as Chinese puppets. Don't mind the straightforward language I use. I'll tell you why. Because what you are saying, your eminent persons group and all did, is something that China announced on the 9th of August 2017. What are you saying, sir? On the, can China, I, how I, did China I, read your mind and allow me to give you the example of this? No, no, let, me really this. let me elucidate this. Let me elucidate this, sir. So with the respect to you, I want to elucidate it. No, 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 no. I want I to elucidate it. I want to elucidate it. I want to elaborate on it. I want to explain to you. I want to explain to you. I want to, I want to explain to you, not with the intention to corner you, sir. I need to explain to you. I need no, to explain no, no, to you no, one no. statement, one statement, Mr. Rijal, one statement, sir, one statement, sir, one statement. Wang Wenli. Wang Wenli is a Chinese official. In 2017, India and China were locked in eyeball to eyeball situation in Doklam. Okay, in Sikkim. China eventually retreated because there was such massive mobilization on the Indian side. They realized. I mean, now, he, let he me tell you. Let, listen to the full story. Listen to this. No, Mr. Renji, please listen. Let me complete. I request you to let me complete. I'll take 10 more seconds. At that time, you know what the Chinese said? The Chinese said the following. What will, you, what will New Delhi do? We have been defeated in Doklam, okay. But what will you do if we enter through the Kalapani region of Nepal? You go and check. How did the Chinese say no, that no, in 2017? No, no, no. You're, you're just it I up. am not making it up, sir. You are astonishingly no, no. unaware on this. This is a comment made by no, Wang Wenli, Deputy Den up. Director General I, of the Boundary and Ocean Affairs, no, no, I mean, if, if, speaking in response look, I mean, I, you, to External Affairs Minister then Sushma Swaraj. Not how it's done. 
Sir, I, I, I very strongly resent it. I, you making your point of view. I am asking you. I am only asking you, sir. How okay. did the Chinese read I your mind? Asking or are you making a statement? How how did the you, Chinese you, read your mind? Question. Not, not statement. statement. Question. How did you the Chinese read your mind? Question. Asking. No statement. How did the Chinese read your mind? You're making a statement. I am asking a question. You're not how did the Chinese raise the Kalapani issue three years back? First of all, I mean you have to understand. Our two governments, government of Nepal and government of ne uh, India, at the secretary level have agreed that uh, this, no this, uh, this is an outstanding issue. We have agreed that I mean we will attend Sir, to I... it. And government of India has said that after the, uh, two countries are uh, done dealing with the uh, Corona crisis, sir, uh, two, uh, two uh, going to uh, secretary level this. meeting can be held. No, and sir. Both, uh, China, uh, government of India Sushant. has said that I mean, we are ready and willing to. No, look we're at not going to talk. And we are okay, ready so and I... to. Uh, uh, okay, 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 Mr. Rajal, Sushant Sarin wants to respond he's, to you. He's constantly Sushant Sarin. Himself Sushant and, Sarin, and, and, please. So, look, I think what Mr. Rajal is saying, uh, I completely disagree. Number one, uh, he keeps talking about respect. Uh, what is the kind of respect his prime minister is showing to India? Forget, forget this business. And if these guys feel so strongly and they think because Nepal has such a strong scientific base that they figured out that the coronavirus which is coming from India and India has spread the coronavirus in Nepal, then they should block the borders. They should they should stop all contact with us, for all I care. Yeah, you stop know, but all the contact. The kind of language the Prime Minister uses, he uses the Ashoka emblem of ours and he takes a dig at us. Is this what uh, good friends are supposed to do? And it's very clear, look, in Nepal, there have been always two strands of opinion. There are people like this clown Oli who think that they will be able to validate their rule by abusing India, by seem to be standing up to India. What side deals they want to cut for themselves and for their cronies is another matter. But they want to show to their people and mislead their people that they are standing up to India, that India is the big ogre. Do these guys have the guts to say something similar about China when the Chinese finger them? Now suddenly, and, and, and Arnab, let me tell you this, for Nepal, this has been an old kind of attack. Under King Mahindra, what they used to do is that they used to play the fiddle with the Pakistanis because they thought that the Pakistanis will be able to, in a sense, defend them. The Pakistanis will be a foil for them uh, as, as a counterbalancing force. After 1971, they suddenly smelled the coffee that this won't happen anymore. So then they again backed off. They have tried to do it with Nepal in the early 90s, late 80s, early 90s, you know, uh, when they started getting into a defense relationship with the Chinese. This is what they did at that point of time. Again, they backed off from that. Now suddenly they see China as this big counterpoint to India and they think that they can press India. They think that they can finger India. And that is what they've been trying to do. So this Kalapani thing, every time the government gets into a bit of a, tang a tangle, they start raising this Kalapani like issue. Now, this issue is not a new one. Prakash it's been a Subhash. very old, outstanding issue. Prakash or but Subhash. Yes, what they have done Mr. recently... Rajan.